So it was on August 23, 1987 that a cargo train was traveling through Alexander, Arkansas when the driver saw something on the tracks ahead. As the train closed in on the object, he could see that it was a body. He then realized that there were in fact two bodies lying across the tracks in the way of his oncoming train, attempting desperately to stop and blowing his horn incessantly. The driver almost succeeded in avoiding hitting the bodies, but unfortunately the train's momentum caused it to roll over them. An investigation revealed that bodies were those of 16-year-old Don Henry and 17-year-old Kevin Ives. Initially, it was suspected that the boys had fallen asleep on the tracks due to their heavy use of marijuana. However, both sets of parents insisted that a second autopsy be conducted. Eventually, a pathologist realized that the marks on Don Henry's shirt were consistent with a stabbing injury and the Kevin Ives' skull had been crushed, possibly by the rifle he used to hunt with. Some witnesses claim to have seen a man dressed in military attire a week before the train incident as well as the same day as the train hit the boys. One theory had it that the boys may have stumbled across a drug dealing operation and they were mur murdered because of it. Police investigated all possible leads, but they all led to a dead end. To date, the boys' killer remains unknown.